everyone, my name is Grace and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Abraham's Big Test, Abraham and Isaac. God promised Abraham a son and from that son many descendants who would bless the whole world. But Abraham made Abraham and his wife Sarah were too old to have children. God has promised Abraham that he will God will give many descendants. Who will bless the whole world? But Abraham and Sarah was too old to have a baby. Twenty years went by. Still, Abraham trusted that God's promise. When he was hundred years old and Sarah was ninety. God reminded them of his promise. Sarah was going to have a baby. So 20 years went by, but still Abraham was trusting God. So God gave Abraham a baby and Sarah was going to have a baby. <laughs> There's a mouse also here. When their son was born, Sarah was so joy joyful that she laughed. God has brought me a laughter, she said. So they named their son Isaac, which means he laughs. So the baby has born and Sarah was joyful. That really God has gave the baby to Sarah. So he named his baby Isaac. It means he loves. <laughs> Question God promised Abraham a son whose descendants will bless the whole world. True. When Isaac was a boy, God tested Abraham by telling him to take Isaac to a mountain. Mora and kill him as a sacrifice to God. Abraham was confused, but he still trusted God. Abraham has really big faith. Because like he's trusting God and also like he had the baby when he was 100 years old but God was like God has promised him and God has gave and now like he's saying to kill Isaac but still Adam
is a character word and Abraham held the knife and torch together they climbed the mountain where is the lamb for the sacrifice asked Isaac God will prove it Abraham replied so Abraham obeyed God and they're going to sacrifice Isaac but like Isaac doesn't know it Abraham arranged the wood on the altar, tied up Isaac and laid him on the wood. As he raised the knife to kill Isaac, an angel called his name. Abraham so Abraham was when wait really he obeyed God and when he was going to kill Isaac God called his name right that God now he loved God and obey. Question, what did God tell Abraham to kill <coughs> as a sacrifice? Number one, the donkey. Number two, Isaac. Number three, the sheep. Number two was the answer. Don't hurt the boy. The angel cried. God knows you trust his promise. Look, there and the bush a ram is cut by its horn sacrifice that instead so God knows that Abraham obeyed God so like oh God prepared the sacrifice So Abraham sacrificed the ram instead of his son. He called the place God will provide because God provided the sacrifice just as God has said. His promise came true. So God has provided what the sacrifice then and Abraham was thanking God for like, keeping his promise every time God kept his promise Question, did Abraham believe God would really keep his promise? Yes. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? And next time I will read another good stories. Then let's see you next time. Bye!